we also want to extend special appreciation to the fathers across the world. Fathers, fathers. They came first, yes, even though it does change much, they came first. Glory to God. Amen. They came first. Hallelujah. And you know, we have biological fathers. Mm -hmm. We have uncle fathers. Am I right? You have big brother fathers. Come on. You have village fathers. You have pastoral fathers. You have all kinds of fathers. Amen. And they're all fathers. Are you there, somebody? The Lord says, strive to be a God father. I know it sounds normal. I know it sounds, you know, oh yes, God father, you know, God father. Ha! God says, strive to be a God father. Somebody said, Lord, give us God fathers. Come on, say, Lord, give us God fathers. That's what's missing. That's what's missing. That's what's missing. You see, in this case, God is an adjective. Yeah, it's an adjective. It's describing who the father should be and how he should be. A God father must be God born. God birth. Are you there? God baptized. God filled. God anointed. Ah, God led. Are you there? Somebody say, Lord, give us God fathers. Lord, give us God fathers. Yes, the Lord says, try to be a God father. It is one thing to be a blood father. But it doesn't take a lot. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry it's good. In marriage. Yeah. But it doesn't take a lot to be a blood father. Come on somebody. Am I right? But it's another thing to be a God father. Come on. You have to be qualified to be a good father. And thank God before you be a blood father, you can be a good father. I was a good father before I became a blood father. Are you there? It's noble to be a... Listen, ladies, listen to what I'm telling you right now. When I'm finished, come on, somebody. Glory to God. You're going to benefit mankind. God says, try. Men, men. Next year we'll preach because I wish I'd get gotten this fight from the mother time, you know, to do the mother one. So you ladies have to wait till next year. Come on. So take this on. Strive, man. Strive, man. To be a God father. Even after you have had children, you have got to strive to come up to be a good father. To not just blood father your children, but good father your children. Somebody help me here. Somebody here. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. You see, most folks only think of blood relations. There are three kinds of blood relations. Three kinds. You have blood, law, and God. And all three are legal. You should be writing some of the stuff I'm saying. You're going to be sorry you didn't write it. Come on. Relationships. Three main relationships. Blood. Law. And God. The blood father is what we know about. Biologically. Law. In law. You dare not banish your in-law. They are your relatives. Bye. 
This one, like, you know, want to say it, you know. <laughs> My God. Huh? But did you know that Godfathers are also by law? <laughs> did you know that it's by law? It's all these modern times as we try to be of strife and of all kind of division. These stuff, you don't hear much of them. In the past, a God parent, come on, was almost as important as any other relative. <laughs> all right, you don't believe me? In British law, Bishop, if you're a God parent, you dare not marry to a God child. British law. <laughs> Go research it. Yeah, that's how important it was. If the blood parent die, is you have to take the child. Law. <laughs> Are you there? Law. It means Godfathering is major. It's major. And I hear God say, that's what's lacking. Blood fathers are everywhere. Everywhere you turn, there are blood fathers. Come on, somebody. But God says it's time to raise up in the church. Come on, somebody. God fathers. This has nothing to do. Don't, don't, don't give God fathership to somebody who is not yet born again. It's God, 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 God. Somebody said, God, Father. I'm going to get in trouble now for three minutes, then I'll, then I'll move on. A God, Father, must be willing to be a martyr. Let me say it again. Let me say the easy part first. Most folks, most folks, they go and ask somebody to be a godfather. You know, like they ask a brother in the church, a pastor, and that's very good. You know what's better? You don't know what's better. You fathers must ask to be a godfather. I'm teaching you something you never hear in church in your life. Come on, it's come out of the scriptures. Come on, you must strive. You must ask. You must look on situations and offer and say, I will father. I will God father this child. I've done it. You just don't know about it. I've done it all across the world. You don't know about it. Say, no, this child. I've got to God father this child. And bring that security. Bring that God fathership into that child life. You don't see that situation and leave it. Come on. And you're a father. Or you're a man. Come on, come on. You don't see a breakdown. I come on, somebody. Get upset, God. And be and say, you know, you know the sister, and you know she's she's saved, sanctified, and, and she's bearing a child. You can say, Can I be the Godfather? Listen, I was in a country, me and one leader right here, in a country, in a country, in a country in South America, and I was there to preach, and one of our leaders was with me. And when we walked through the door to go into the church, there was a dedication going on. Oh yeah, a, de a dedication for baby. You know what? The, the leader was walking with me, walked right up to the restroom to be a godfather. You never, you ever, ever seen that? That's the leading of the Holy Ghost. Walk, we walk into the church and they are walking us up. And the leader walk right there with a dedication and he's standing right there. I will be a God. That's what I'm talking about. You don't see those stuff. What are you going to strive to be a Godfather? Watch me now. A Godfather must be willing to be a martyr. A martyr. You know the martyr? Right? They're willing to die. Watch this now. Willing to be a martyr for the creator. Write it down. Write it down. Write it down. <laughs> Number two. They must, a Godfather must be willing to be a, a martyr for the church. <laughs> Come on. 
and a godfather must be willing to be a martyr for the children. Watch me now. When a godfather is a martyr for the creator, it means he's willing to die for the Lord. He's willing to die for the gospel. It's not negotiable. I heard our, our early speaker was talking about it. There's no negotiation. He will die. He'll be a martyr for the creator. Come on, somebody. Somebody say, Godfather. Somebody say, Lord, give us Godfathers. Number two, he must be a Godfather, must be a martyr for the church. This part I'm going to get in trouble right now. If you have a mask, put it on good now. So you don't have to say hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Watch me now. A martyr for the church means that you will die for the church. Mean that you will sacrifice for the church. Mean that you will give your second house to the church. Mean that you will give your third car to the church. It's first I want to say, but come on, somebody. Did you hear what I'm saying? I've got father, there's a father, my father is the highest. I've got father will ensure that the church don't struggle. I've got father, come on, remember, remember the children came from the father. Most folks in the children came from the mother. I'm not getting that stuff here. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't know that. The children came from the father. They have all some, can I get in trouble? Somebody said, Bishop, get in trouble. You really say it? You married folks who still using your original name and won't use your, your new married name? Come on. I'm talking about Mary Jane Duncans. <laughs> or Mary James Duncan. No, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. You know, acknowledge the full release from your husband. That's why you have more problem than normal. No, no perfect, don't talk this stuff, yeah. Oh my God, oh my. Did he hear I said, no, 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 drop it. Drop it. You could be my daughter, drop Collins. <laughs> Whoa. I told my daughter, don't do it, don't, don't, don't follow them. It comes from the father. It comes from, from the head. Yeah, say amen. amen. Yeah. Someone say, Lord, give us Godfathers. Listen, as a Godfather, you must be willing to be a martyr for the church. Do you know what I said? A martyr for the church. You're willing to sign a will that when you go, the church will not struggle. You're willing to take out an insurance that if you go, the church gets something. <laughs> Someone said, Godfather, you have to be willing to be a martyr for the church. Did you hear that? A will, a house, a land, a car, an insurance. You want to ensure. Almost every successful pastor had to be a martyr for the church to stand. Get, get the history and see what he had to do. If he didn't do it, it would have happened. My God of mercy. I hate me somebody. Somebody said, God Father. Somebody said, Lord, give us. To number one, to be a, a good father, you've got to be willing to be a martyr. What we now for what? For the creator. Number two, a martyr for what? The church. And number three, a martyr for the children. Listen, fathers, you have to, as long as you pass mid-age, you have to have something that if you go, your children have something. <laughs> we have time to go into the Bible. If the Bible said it, you got to leave something for your children. If the Bible said it, you don't have to go off and leave nothing. Send you up, you spin it off just for your generation. That's mean. 
<laughs> come on, I'm talking badly here, I'm done. Come on, somebody. Come on, fathers. Not just to pay your rent. Not just to pay your mortgage. Not just to buy a third car. Ha ha. Your children. If you have to go, they must not be broke. What can I, I thought I thought I'd come here to hear some Holy Ghost things here. This evening here. Come on. Tell my wife, oh, you should not you should not ask me. You should not ask Bishop to say nothing. Yeah. You've got to. Listen. You have to have a will. Oh, you have to take on insurance. Come on, you pass me the edge. Come on. Come on. Listen, I do this from I was 30. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ho, ho, ho. You think I'm gonna go and leave them struggling? Ho ho ho! I'm doing it for my party. <laughs> yeah. Watch me now. Watch it. Watch me now. It's not tough. You just take out a life insurance. When you pay a little bit, it's not gonna be a struggle. You pay like thirty dollars a month. Is it? Huh? And it's over. That's for the insurance, man. Is it? As a gut father. The Godfather, the Godfather, you know, so live to die and live for ourselves. Come on, I want to get in trouble more. Come on, some of them get in trouble. I got a mercy, and there, every year you're using your your equity as 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 a, as a, as a, as a oh, what do you call the machine again? As a ATM. Forget your children every year, every year. Ten years of equity, no, you're gone on to two months of equity. Oh my God, you know. Come on, somebody. Remember your children. Remember your children. Godfather, Godfather, Godfather. Be willing to be a martyr for the Creator. Come on, for what? The church and for the children. There was a man in the Bible, his name was Mordecai. And he was not the physical father of Esther. But he was a cousin father. Come on, somebody. And he took charge of Esther's life and became a godfather. He was her cousin, but he became her godfather. And he worked on her. When he was finished working on her, she became the wife of the king. Some of you fathers, you need to become a godfather to get that woman married. You shouldn't give me the mic here. Just sit down and that, 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 that lady reach certain age and you just go in and no, get to work. <laughs> All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Someone say, Lord, give us Godfathers. Give him praise. Give the Lord some praise. Give the Lord some praise here. Yeah. Give the Lord some mighty praise here. Yeah. Ooh, ba 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 ba, sata da ba ba, raga ba ba. Yes, that's what the Lord said. Blood fathers is good, but try to be a good father. Amen.